Ready, set, bake. Not sure what to serve for dessert at your next get-together? Mini fluted tube cakes made with this Wilton non-stick mini cake pan are a simple, yet impressive treat for any get-together. Multi-use. The Wilton multi-cavity mini fluted tube pan lets you make several individual desserts at once. This pan can also be used to make ice cubes for punch bowls, as a gelatin or ice cream mold and is great for mini pound cakes, too. Non-stick. No matter what you're making, the durable non-stick and scratch-resistant coating on our cake pans allows your food to slide or pop out easily, making cleanup almost effortless. Non-stick bakeware sets are a must-have for busy cooks. Quick cleanup. The Wilton cake pans are dishwasher safe. However for best results, wash in warm, soapy water before first and after each use. If you're a frequent baker, these should be a staple in your kitchen. Top reviews from the United States. Love these cute little pans. While eating a bowl of strawberries last week and wishing I had pound cake and whipped cream to go with them, I had an epiphany for what to serve at my daughter's wedding open house, little bunt cakes with strawberries and whipped cream. But did such a thing as a mini bunt pan exist? I searched online and found that such a pan did indeed exist. I then armed myself with 40% off coupons for my two local craft supply stores, both of which are well stocked with Wilton pans. I quickly discovered that the mini bunt pan was apparently the only Wilton pan neither store carried thanks to Amazon, I could still get my pans, and in only two days with free Super Saver shipping, the speed of shipping surprised me as usually Super Saver takes over a week I have made three different cake recipes using this pan. Two recipes gave me a thick batter that I had to spoon into the cavities. The third was a runnier batter that I poured in. According to the use directions that come with the pans, I sprayed the cavities with cooking spray before baking. When the cakes were done baking, I immediately inverted the entire pan on a cooking rack for 10 minutes. When I lifted the pan, I had varying results, based on the batter type. The thicker, spooned-in batters worked great and there was absolutely no sticking. The thinner batter told a different tale. Even with the spray, many of the cakes stuck in the pans, completely or partially. These are great little pans for thick battered cakes but I do not recommend them for use with normal, runnier cake recipes. As the cakes are wider on the bottom than they are on the top, opposite of a traditional cupcake, Traditional cupcake papers, liners needed some modification for the cakes to fit nicely in them. What I did was find a plastic cup that had a bottom diameter slightly larger than the cake. I then pressed down on the paper with the cup. The cup made a new bottom crease in the paper and the sides still stood upright, though shorter. The cakes fit into the papers nicely after the modification.